Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to disassemble a BlackBerry 8830, which is also similar to the 8800. Um, I couldn't find any good videos on YouTube or the internet on how to fully disassemble this uh, device. So, anyway, hopefully this will help you guys maybe fix some of the problems that there are with this device. Um, anyway, obviously you want to take off the back cover, take out the battery. Uh, what you're going to need next is a, uh, a Torx screwdriver. Now I'm not really sure if this is a T5 or a T4, uh, so you might have to try it out. But it's got a little star pattern on there. It's actually uh, pretty difficult to find. But once you find it, um, you want to take out these four screwdrivers, four screws at this point. These four screws hold the uh, chrome side pieces in. You're not going to be able to take the sides off until you get these screws out. Much of this phone is held together with double-sided tape. When I took it apart the first time, I found that it was just really stuck together in a lot of places. And I thought I was going to break it by pulling it apart, but it was really just the tape coming in glued. So anyway, there's those four screws. Now the next thing uh, to do is to try to remove these chrome pieces on the side. And what I actually like to do is use the, uh, the back cover to uh, pry it off. Now what you want to know is there's two hooks at the top of the black brace. You want to actually start at the bottom to try to pull these out. Um, and what I like to do is I squeeze the phone at this point and then work my way up. So anyway, I take this cover and you can kind of wedge it in here and run it up the side. And it will pop the clips off and then there's the two hooks up top so you kind of want to pull it off slide it up and again there's double sided tape here uh, this, just holding it you know sticking it on so anyway just pull it up at the bottom squeeze here helps to compress and undo the hooks and then slide it forward like so again double sided tape here and here all right, so with that in mind, um, it starts to come apart a little bit right here. Uh, you want to try to get this top cover off. Now, this is really just clipped in, and you know, what I'll use here is a uh, flathead screwdriver. And as you can see, it just starts to come apart. There are again two hooks up here, more double sided tape. This chrome part you want to have come off with the cover. So pushing forward and up, and there's a couple of grooves in here where this uh, power button is uh, hooked into. So that's this is probably the more difficult part of the phone because I don't want to try to break that button. There it came. All right. Now most videos stop at this point um, with this this well this assembly, but I'm going to take this black cover off as well. Um, and then I weigh two more torque screws for a total of six.
All right, from this point, the uh, front cover can come off. Again, there's that double-sided tape holding it on. Um, so at which point you can replace the screen if it's broken. Mine's not broken. What is broken is the USB port. Uh, the plastic part of the inside of the mini USB port has come out and uh, now it won't charge and now I can't get my data off of it. So um, that, uh, that led me to take this apart. So next you want to take this back black cover off. Uh, there's a clip on the side here, here also on the opposite side here and here uh, and then again on the top there's two clips just sort of hooking it on um, the other thing to note is there's a bottom part that just slides straight down and off not exactly sure what that is maybe a microphone um, anyway there's also a white cable that also can unplug uh, because it's attached to the top black case here so again, getting something pointy, uh, you could even use a uh, thumbtack to get in underneath these clips and try to lift them apart. Um, fingernail even works. Okay, obviously I forgot to take out this SIM card, so I was stopping that from coming up. Alright, so there it is. A little uh, bit of effort and you can get it apart. So there's the uh, the white cable has a connector there, super tiny connector. Um, then that's the uh, end of my video, the disassembled uh, BlackBerry 8830. Uh, there's the uh, broken mini USB port. Um, I'm going to attempt to try to solder that, uh, unsolder that, and get a new one put on there so I can get my data off. Um, it does look like a really tough job though to do the. Uh, the solders are extremely close together and there's resistors right next to it. So anyway, thanks for watching the video.